Hello lovely people. I hope you have an amazing day. Today just grab your favorite cup of tea and enjoy. It will be a very very chill video. We're gonna go through my latest painting that I've done for my last Valentine's Day in 2021. Every year I try and make a painting or a drawing illustration for my wife regarding any occasion, let's say a birthday, anniversary and it's something I've been doing it since we've ever dated and I always want to keep that tradition as long as I'm alive because I like to keep it all authentic and I don't think the other like artists can get what I want to say and most of my art related to her is very personal this was the painting that I've done for her on the last Valentine's it really meant a lot to me so for this one she always liked this new song that came out by Lady Gaga and Ariana, which uh, has this verse that say, I'll be your galaxy. So always she always says that to me, like, I'll be your galaxy. So that kind of gave me this inspiration was like, you know what, let's do an astronaut. And I wanted to get that astronaut that's going in space. So I got all my shapes done and I just wanted to get the general form and what I wanted to have for that suit because each suit has a different thing and I wanted to have a little bit of grit to it I didn't want it to keep it very hyper realistic so I wanted to put some a little bit of uh, surreal elements to it I wasn't very sure about the face which is something I'm gonna be going back and forth with but now I'm just adding in all the shapes blocking in the details especially with when it comes to fabric now I'm adding touches to the suit itself, trying to get some details and uh, to block away some of the imperfections and to get everything kind of tight into that painting. The small details really make everything pop. And the one thing I wanted to make sure I get right is the fabric on the legs. So I'm just blocking in all the shapes and making sure everything looks cohesive. And now that I have the legs done, I'm just going to change a little bit in the background and now I wanted to do the oxygen tank and I was exploring a little bit with the galaxy um, but I didn't like it so much and I wanted to do something like probably like a satellite or something because I wanted it to be in space but I wasn't too sure what I wanted because that was not pre-planned and usually when I draw I kind of keep it all spontaneous and see what the painting is gonna give to me so sometimes I have a lucky mistake and I just go with it but when I painted the last object they kind of made me think I was like why don't I just make a fishbowl because I'm a Pisces so I thought well if she's taking me everywhere then she is really my galaxy and I took all of the oxygen hoses and I wanted to make sure like I give her oxygen and she gives me oxygen and that will kind of portrays that we both give, give each other life. And that way we are, well, since the pandemic hit, we kind of been home for the most part. We've been spending a lot more time together and we kind of exploring what we like and what we dislike about each other, even though we've dated for so long, but you don't really know a person. And the more you spend time with them, you get to know them better on a deeper level. I'm kind of known to go down and if I try and draw something innocent, I go and, and do something crazy. So I kind of keep reminding myself, I'm like, hey, this is supposed to be a Valentine Day card. Just tone it down. So I, every time I try something, I remind myself and slap myself on the wrist and go back. But I just opted to have like, you know what? Maybe I'll make it a faceless uh, astronaut to give it a little bit more uh, mood and mystery. And I added the maple leaf and the tie flag and this is how the painting looks and i really like how it ended up it's um it's a little bit more minimalistic and if you have any questions about the techniques and the programs i'm using please put them in the comments below and i'm gonna keep everything in the description and until then i'll see you in the next video